lalo mong gamitin ang iyong mga manggagawa, Panginoon. Sa pangunguna ng aming buti. Ano po kayo naging parte ng Street and Food Evangelistic Ministries? Uh, Sino sa kayo naliligaw sa mga isang pagkaunawa ko, binigyan niya ako ng tamang wisdom para makipatagpuan o makilala mo ang aking pastors. Kasi ayaw ko ang buha siya ang nagpuro sa akin na paano ko gawin ang tama at makilala ng lukusan na kanyang mga sa'yo. Uh, dati akong katolik. Napunta ako dito sa China, tapos nakilala ko sila Brother Serge, sila Brother Nilo. Brother Serge siya yung nag-aya sa akin sa Bible study. Tapos nagtuloy-tuloy hanggang sa sineran ako ni Kuya Dani ng uh, gospel at uh, tumanggap ako. At uh, yun, baptize ako sa uh, Christian. Paano ako naging part ng STEM? Eh, tinawag ako ng Diyos dito. Marami nag uh, ano sa akin. Naaralan na po. Pero ang nagdala sa akin, si Brother Mario, sa pamamagitin nga ng Diyos, tinawag ako ng Diyos sa gawain nito. We became a member of this ministry through Brother Daniel Campo. He was introduced by a mutual friend five years ago and he gathered us in learning that words, making sure all his preaching are found in the Bible. Thank you, Brother Thank you, Daniel. Si Pastor kasi, kami Mr. Sally magka-opisina. He started sharing the Word of God to Mr. Sally and then until he offered to have a Bible study sa bahay namin. Personally, hindi ako nahirapan tagapil kasi that's what I believe at that time. After that, pero kaming baptisman, after the baptisman, sa Catholic, at that time Catholic pa kami, dapat magpapabaptize na rin kami. Kaya lang, oh, mukhang talaga hindi sinatangayon ng Panginoon. Akong nauna, And then, narinig ko kay Pastor, I was his firstborn. That's that. And then, Sister Shali, my mother-in-law, Brother Gallo, Sister Weng, Sister Nina, Tinya. Tinya. And then, si Father Bong, saka may ikuti din. Nanganak na nanganak hanggang nagkaroon ng STEM. Ano po nakatulong ang Spirit and Truth Ministries sa inyong paglago bilang isang Kristiyan? Nagmula nung uh, nag-umpisa pa lang ako, yan sila, Kuya Dani, ginagayad nila ako sa pastor. Uh, patuloy akong nag-grow, kahit na medyo busy sa work. Malaki, malaki ang naitulong ng STEM sa akin. Uh, nagbago sa buhay ko magmula nung uh, nakilala ko. My family and I are trying our best to be better individuals by remembering God's love and suffering. And STEM? always helps us and reminds us, encourages us to study the Bible with all our hearts. Laging tulong yan sa aming family. Asawa ko dati kasi hindi siya pala si Upa. So, so nang gamating si Pastor, naging susi siya para magkabuklod-buklod kami. So, lang, we go to church as a family. So, na-encourage ko din yung ibang part ng family ko. Doon ko nakita kasi yung ano eh. Kung pa paano nakita ng malagad yung Holy Spirit na yun na oh, hindi lang apoy, hindi lang pumasok sa akin, hindi lang apoy na yun. Kung kamoy ka ngayon sa pamamagitan ng Holy Spirit na pinakita ng Diyos sa akin, naging matatag ako, nasabi ko, tuloy, nasabi ko sa akin sarili, nasa katotohanan na ako. Sa pag-attend ng Bible studies, marami ako natutunan sa salita ng Panginoon. Sa bang uh, pag-encourage ni Pastor, nagpupunta siya, ang revenue ang kanyang effort para ang kanyang mga tao ay makatinig ng mga salita ng gusto ng Panginoon para sa atin. Siya ang naging tulay sa, aming, sa aking group. Parang binigyan ako ng espiritu na patuloy pa rin dahil niya sa encouragement ng ating Pastor. And then yung mga tulong din ng ating mga kasamahan na ngayon ay wala na. Pero naka-encourage din sila sa akin. Iba kasi yung may fellowship ka. Ibang fellowship ang naramdaman ko noon sa church ng STEM. Para kami magkakapatid, nagtutulungan ano man ang problema. We encourage everyone Friday, overnight. So yun, nakaganda sa aking spiritual growth. Same with me, pwede pang kapitation. Kung itagdag ko na lang yun, sharing, yung pagpapaliwanag ng pastor, napakalaking, napakalaking bagay nun para maintindihan ng sakta ng Diyos, kung sino si Jesus. Doon ko nakilala ang Diyos at doon ko sinusagala at doon ako umasita sa niya. And there was a time na medyo nawendang kami. Nung bumalik kami, Sister Ella was also there. 
she almost cried and nagpatuto siya dahil she was praying for us sana makabalik kami yung prayers ng kapatiran natin malaking bagay yung, yung foundation of knowledge and the learning from our elders from the pastor and from the church and the fellowship that make us stronger ano po yung panalangin nyo para sa buong simbahan lumago ang salita ng Diyos sa kanila at lumago ang pananampalataya ng bawat isa. Prayers ko para sa ating mga kapatid at sa buong STEM. Sana uh, patuloy pa tayong patatagin ng Lord at uh, patuloy tayong gabayan at uh, patuloy niyang palawakin ang ating iglesia. Yun lang mga kapatid at maraming salamat. God bless you all. And so we pray for this church to be stronger than ever. To realize that God never makes us feel hopeless. We all mean so much to Him. So it's time to make Him feel very invaluable, praying that we repay God with pure intentions. Always look up to God and always look after one another. In Jesus' name we pray. Everybody say, Amen. Amen. Thank you. According to the Lord, uh, ang panahin ko lang na talagang ano yung uh, wit niya o yung nais niya at hindi yung nais ko na masunod hindi yung makakabuti para sa kalooban at hindi pa yung makakabuti para sa kalooban First, I would like to thank uh, for the unity in faith and love We lift up our hearts and voices in prayer seeking the gadgets of the Lord strength and blessings for our brethren in this church. We thank you, Lord, for the gift of fellowship and the opportunity to come together as a family of believers. We are grateful for the unique talents, gifts, and experiences you have bestowed upon each member of our congregation. I pray for spiritual growth and deepening of faith of our brethren and our mothers and mga kapataan natin. At siyempre, gusto ko rin na sana magkaroon tayo ng mas palaking church. Uh, doon, hindi na tayo hahanap pag mag-anniversary tayo at doon na lang tayo i-worship para tayo nasa bahay lang ng Panginoon. Sana, Lord, hindi mo na ito sa amin. Na-pray for the pastor, mama? Specific pray for the pastor? Lord, we pray for wisdom and abound in the heart and mind for our pastor. Amen. Grant him discernment as he study your word and prepares sermons, that he may rightly divide the truth and bring forth messages that touch the heart of your people. Give him insight and understanding to navigate the complexities of our world and the issues faced by our congregation. We also pray for protection of our pastor. Guard him against attacks of enemy, both seen and unseen. Surround him with your angels, that they may be shielded from harm and evil influences. Protect his reputation and his character that he may be an example of righteousness and integrity to all. And lastly, Lord, we pray for unity and support within the congregation. Help us to be a source of encouragement and love to our pastor. Give us hearts that are willing to serve and assist him in his ministry. Help us to be diligent in praying for him and to extend grace and forgiveness when he is stumbled. This is our prayer for everyone. Thank you so Thank much. You and happy happy 35th anniversary. Congratulations sa ating uh, buting pastor, Pastor Bing Josiah Ocampo, and uh, sa ating lahat. Uh, congratulations dahil uh, naubot natin ang uh, ika 35th anniversary ng ating iglesia. Ako'y uh, dumadalangin na uh, ang iglesia ito ay lalo pang gamitin ng ating uh, Panginoon Yesus para mas marami pang kaluluwa ang mga ligtas. And in behalf of uh, STEM China, I would like uh, to greet every one of you. Happy anniversary and more power sa ating lahat. Hi everyone, I just wanted to say that I'm blessed and encouraged by each and every one of you that is continuing to serve our Lord and um, continue to serve Him faithfully and God has been so good to us and just continue on with the path and the 
um, what the Lord has given you and um, be, let's be blessing to each and everyone and I'm thankful for all our pastors, our preachers, our evangelists, our staff and just each and every member of our church. Um, let's be um, encouragement to each and every one, to each other and may God bless us all. Happy 35th anniversary to everyone at Spirit and Truth Ministries. I still believe